it's invigorating to be fully engaged in something that's so important to somebody who has trusted you with their care. How would it be to have my father sitting here with an advanced lung cancer? How would it be to have my sister here who needs a transplant? We want to prolong your life. So if you're a mountain climber, you're a water skier, we want to do everything we can to give you your life back. And if somebody believes that they can get back to that life, that's a strong motivation for, for getting through the, the storm of operations and chemotherapy and whatever else is required to achieve that. And I've just always wanted to challenge convention in the hopes of it making an improvement. The minimally invasive surgery aspect of things is, is thriving here. We're not talking about people being able to get up and maybe vacuum in three weeks. We're talking about getting people back to full activity in three weeks in the overwhelming majority of cases. And they're not on narcotics anymore. Sometimes they're not on anything. They're not even on Tylenol sometimes. It's very impressive. And more recently, and what's really exciting, is we've shown that folks that require chemotherapy after surgery tolerate it much better and are much more likely to complete their chemotherapy if they had a VATS as opposed to an open lung procedure. I love it. I mean, that, that, that's the thing is you get to see how excited people are and, and how this work really does result in something that's different than, you haven't, than you've seen before. And that, that's, that's very rejuvenating.